Now we're on the third floor reception area, and this is where all the you know, kind of day-to-day -day operations will take take place. Coaches' offices, meeting rooms, player meeting rooms, player lounge, and all that kind of stuff. So this is day-to-day -day activity. This is where the whole staff will be spending most of their time. This is the reception area uh, where we'll have some secretary administrative staffs out front for anybody to come to see the coaches and hang out. And then we'll follow me. We'll go through uh, my new office, which I haven't seen here in a in a, in a couple of months. Guys are working hard in here. So, as you see, they're putting up some drywall. I'm gonna have a nice little corner office that I can see the, see the Foothill Mountains. I can see anybody that's uh, coming down the street. Uh, that glass, from what I understand, is bulletproof and rockproof in case we have a bad day. You know, nobody will be able to hit, hit me. And I may put my desk in the corner anyway, but this, this is gonna be a nice setup. Uh, for me as well and then this room here I'm really excited about I call the closing room so when we have a recruit and their family in and, and they've had a great visit they've seen everything about the U of A everything that our university and our athletic department has to offer I'm gonna bring the, the young man and his parents or his guardians or his coaches in here and put on a little TV put on the highlights a little bit and talk about to, the, to them about committing to the University of Arizona so this is going to be set up like somebody's living room like my living room hopefully and and it'll be a very comfortable atmosphere for me to sit down with recruits and prospects. And also, uh, you know, for our current players, I like to meet with those guys on a time to time basis, just to talk to them about things outside of football and have them be in a comfortable setting. And so instead of sitting behind a desk, like they're going to the principal's office, we'll be able to sit on, on a couple couches, a couple chairs and be nice and relaxed and show them that atmosphere. This is going to be one of the kind in, a, in the entire country. And uh, it's going to be our own NFL scout room. You know, we have NFL scouts come just about every practice uh, in the fall, and, and obviously they make their ways through the spring. So we wanted to have a room which is devoted simply to them. They'll have a computer set up, they'll have video set up, and they'll have a comfortable area where they can come in and watch film on any of our student athletes if they want to. Uh, if they want to sit and meet with any of the coaches, if they want to sit with, with the student athletes during pro day and things like that, this will be set up as our NFL pro room. And certainly for the scouts that come in, we want to treat them as well as anybody or better than anybody in the country. So they're going to have their own room right here. It'll be a dorm with some NFL helmets and stickers and, and all the history of, of our guys that are in the NFL right now. This is going to be an area where I, I know our guys are going to spend a lot of free time. And this is going to be our players lounge. And, and uh, we'll have a multiple uh, TVs, Xbox, Playstations, a pool table, maybe a ping pong table. Uh, we'll have plenty of couches. A little, a kind of a little kitchen for them as well, and our guys will spend a lot of time over there. As a parent, uh, you always wonder where your kids are doing when they're not around. You know, one reason we wanted to have a great players lounge is because if you know our players are here, they're going to be doing the right things, and I don't have to worry about them and all that. So I'm really excited about that. I think our players will love it here. They'll kind of be a home away from home, and it'll be a, a, a chance for them to relax. You know, they, if they want to think football, they can think football. But if they want to get away from it and watch TV or shoot pool or something like that, this will be their area. You know, the coaches may come in to say hello, but other than that, I want our players to be able to enjoy themselves and, and have, a, have a great refined area for them to, to lounge around in. Now we're standing in uh, our, going to be our brand new team meeting room. And we're, as you can see, the floor is tiered. We'll have 125 seats for our guys, so they'll all be able to have a comfortable, really nice seat, cushioned seats, and be able to look at the front. We're gonna have a huge screen uh, TV so we can watch film as a whole group, uh, whether it's a special teams group or offense, defense, we can pull the whole team in there. Uh, I'll be able to speak and sit in front of them or the coordinators or position coach and be able to address the whole group in a, a nice, comfortable situation. Again, it's tiered. These seats will be extra wide, extra big for all of our big guys and be plenty of room for our guys to be very, very comfortable in. And it leads out these doors right into their own individual meeting rooms or walk right out into their players' lounge that they can relax as well. So again, it'll be one of the best, best in the country. We're gonna have a lot of graphics, a lot of neat pictures both on the side of the walls and both in front for them to look at as well. And this is one of our individual meeting rooms, but it's also going to serve as a full defensive team meeting room and a media room. In other words, if we want to have a full defensive meeting in one room and a full offensive meeting in another room, we've got plenty of space to do this as well. This also will serve as our linebacker meeting room. And then after our games for our post-game press conferences or our in-season uh, press conferences, we'll have this set up for a nice area for the media to come as well. <music>